Don't do anything, Rash, son. It's not worth it. God's sake, there's only 30 minutes to go. I just fancied a fag, that's all. <laughs> well, why didn't you ask me? There's no need to steal. <laughs> oh, <I'm> sorry. <laughs> what was that? It's the staff arriving. They start early, don't they? Quarter past four. It's half <laughs> past seven! <laughs> Bloody watch. <laughs> so, only half an hour to go. It's sad, really. We might never meet again. Could always hold a reunion next year if you like. You know. <coughs> I remember who you are now. No, no, it's all right, it's all right, son. You can have a full rebate, no problems, all right? <laughs> You're, uh, what is it? No. Uh, don't tell me. No. Tell. Yeah. No. Del. Del Trotter, right? Don't you recognise me? Well, you're the master of disguise, aren't you? Eh? <laughs> Do you remember Rosanna Gilby, West Indian lady? Lives down Clutter Road. Years ago. Used to come round on the weekly and that, selling shoes, Del. Yes, I remember. And that was you. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you remember a little boy? A little... No, no, you're not. You're not little, little Lennox. That's why it's me, Lennox Gilby. Lennox Gilby, I don't believe it. What a stone me. The last time I saw you, you was about that eye. God dear. Doesn't time fly, eh? Yeah. Ah. So what are you doing with yourself now? <laughs> oh, well, I'm on the dole, Del. Oh, yeah. How's your mum? Oh, she's all right. Suffers from her feet a bit. But... Yeah, well, she does. <laughs> Wait a minute. Hang about. I remember your mum. I remember very straight lady, proud churchgoer and all that. Yeah. She won't know nothing about this, Del. Oh, no. How are you going to explain away £60,000 then, eh? Christmas bonus from the job centre. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, Lennox, there are millions of people out there in the same boat as you, but they don't go around robbing everyone. Look, I haven't had a job right in six years. Well, nor has Rodney. I've got no future. Nor has Rodney. <laughs> A day's work since I left school, Del. It's a tough old world, man. It's a tough world. But it doesn't give you the right to go around pointing guns at people. That thing is going to put you in prison. Nah, I'm too shrewd. Oh, you're shrewd, are you? Shrewd, are you? Very shrewd. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. An hour ago, you were a shadow, right? A man of mystery. Now we know your name, your address, and your mum's shoe size. <laughs> Come on, Lennox. Give it up now before it's too late. Eh? That gun doesn't suit you. In 20 minutes, Del, I'll be rich. And in 30 minutes, you're going to be banged up. Yeah. I'll tell you why, shall I? Let's just review the situation for a second, right? All the staff have arrived, right? They started a work out there. Now, you've got to walk through them, haven't you? They're all out there, the shelf packers, the porters, the cleaners, security people. The shop doesn't open till half past eight, right? Now, in order to get out, you've got to go up Ask one of them to go and get the keys to let you out. Before you can say please, sniper, there'd be more lead flying about than a fight in the scrapyard. <laughs> yeah, you'd never reach your getaway car. Getaway car? <laughs> 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 <laughs>